So one of the benefits of being able to make content and make content for my own channel and make content for the Clear Crypto's channel is be able to record that content anywhere. So let's call it what it is, right? I'm in my truck. My son is actually in a gym across the street uh, practicing lacrosse. And so there you go. But as always, um, Clear has the dedication to you, the viewer, as well as I'm trying to continue to help you uh, navigate crypto. And so uh, that's what I'm here for, to answer a question that I've asked myself before. There's this kind of battle raging, if you will, in the community token space. And if you really look at community tokens, there's really three main ones. There's Dogecoin, the grandfather, biggest market cap of them all out there. Um, then there's Shiba Inu, market cap of about $6 billion dollars active ecosystem development. By the way, Dogecoin, really no ecosystem development. I'm not saying that in a bad way about Doge. I own Doge. I like Doge, right? I think that Dogecoin has its utility as it relates to potentially a currency, uh, things of that nature. By the way, drop in the comments below. What do you think? Elon Musk buying Twitter. Do you think he's going to put Doge in as a payment system inside of Twitter? Food for thought, right? So Shiba Inu, ecosystem uh, second, if you will, from market capitalization, uh, and definitely a lot going on with that. I cover Shiba Inu for Clear Crypto's channel as well as for my own channel, uh, and and I am I definitely know a lot about uh, you know about SHIB. Is it going to win the war? Is it going to win the battle, if you will? And then the third one that's up and coming is Terra Luna Classic. Obviously, the rebirth of Terra Luna in in the capacity of being reborn as a community token. Are they going to enter into the fray and become the another big community token initiative quite possibly right we need to see utility come out of them we need to see some some positiveness from that standpoint but a lot in the last month or so we've had a lot of real positive developments as as far as uh you know terra luna coming online burns being initiated very active community very very much a vocal advocate out there some good stuff happening with terra luna but ultimately the point of the video is which one will emerge as the winner. And right here, right now, I would say that Shiba Inu has the lead and will continue to have the lead for the foreseeable future. Um, it's got obviously a lot more runway in, in the context of the utility that's being built out around the Shiba Inu ecosystem. And I think that ultimately for me, that's what it comes down to. It's utility, right? Now, Terra Luna Classic has got some games that are coming on board that are moving their games onto the Terra Luna blockchain. We'll see how that develops. Uh, They're implementing burns associated with that. So those are some interesting utility-based developments. But we'll see how the utility landscape you know, plays out for Terra Luna Classic. Right here, right now, Shibin is winning the battle, if you will, not necessarily from a market cap standpoint, but from an overall kind of active development and active, uh, you know, just actively building out. Again, so I want to know your thoughts. Drop in the comments below. With that said, um, yeah. So if you're interested in Clear Cryptos, the link's down in the description. Check out their new Instagram. Uh, they've got 20,000 plus followers over on Twitter. Get involved in the Discord. That's where a lot of the new launch information is going to be. As always, I thank you for your time. And uh, Clear Cryptos is going to change the game in a positive way when it comes out. With all that said, I'll see you. Have a good one.